Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Malik Wajante. I know, I know, it's been a while. But guys, let me tell you, my MacBook, it had some issues. It was a line down the middle. I had to take it to Apple. I had to send it off. I had to wait for it to come back. So, you know, your girl's been without her editing software for a little bit. So, I wasn't able to do anything. But we're back. Back, back, back again to do this lovely video. Um, I feel like sometimes we lose track of time and forget that we need to take care of ourselves sometimes and brows is one of those things. So sometimes I forget to get my brows done. Shoot me, whatever. Um, so in those stages where I'm trying to get them back together, I need to figure out a way to conceal that I haven't had them done. And in this video, that is what I'm gonna show you how I handle these brows in that in-between stage. You feel me? Well, if you want to see how I do it, go ahead and stay tuned and you'll see how I get these <laughs> cute brows, girl. Yes, yes. All right, y'all. So we know these eyebrows is mm, not good at all. So we need to like tame them until I make this lovely appointment with my best friend to get these brows taken care of because right now they look scary. So I try and comb them and get them going to some type of, some type of direction, whatever that may be. And I wanna go ahead and open up my dip brow from Anastasia Beverly Hills. Um, it's in a color dark brown. So I'm gonna go ahead and use this angle brush and tap into it a few times. Guys, I've had this for so long, like, it's probably going on a year and a half and I still have this much product left. So it's definitely worth it. So I'm gonna start with this left eyebrow and we're gonna create that line where we want our eyebrows to start. And I tend to like pull on my eyebrow where I want the arch to be so it'll elongate my brow and I can get it as sharp and tight as possible. Now, because my eyebrows are a little bit unruly, it's a little bit harder to just get the line where I want it to be. So, take your time, no rush. And then since I have my bottom line done, I'm gonna go at the top, but I don't start all the way over here. I don't like the boxy look, not cute. So, I'm gonna start up here. And then right where I want it to arch at, I start to curve it and bring it on down and connect. Curve, bring it on down. All right guys, so I've done a little arch of where I want it to be and then I go in and fill it in. It's just like coloring, but it's your eyebrows. Yes, ma'am. And we're gonna do what we just did on this side to this side. Okay. Now once I've done this part, filled this portion in, I like to work in the inside and just do small strokes upward. No specific direction, just upward, outward, you know, create some fake strokes there. And then we're gonna go back in with our spoolie that we used to comb out our eyebrows earlier. 
just trying to blend it out so it's not as harsh and not as crazy looking. I'm gonna use our, if I can write it the right way, the LA Girl Pro Conceal. And this is in the color Fawn. So I wanna go ahead, clearly I use this a lot because it's not that much product left in here. So not too much, nothing crazy. We're gonna use about this much concealer. From there we're gonna use like a, it's a rounded brush. If you can see it, go ahead and dip that. And then we're gonna follow underneath, still holding where it was at. And just clean up those brows. Now, once again, I haven't had my eyebrows done in forever. So there's some hair that's gonna be there, but we're using concealer to conceal that, you know? No one has time. And then I'll pull it down, pull it down, pull it down, pull it down. And then at the top, I don't like to use too much concealer because I don't want the highlighter eyebrows, but I do go To the top and just clean it up a little bit. Let that sit and then go to the other eyebrow and do the same thing, you know. From there, girlfriend, we're going in with that handy dandy Q-tip. And we're just gonna blend it out. Do the same at the top. And then go in where you see it to be a little scarce, where you may have missed a little bit of product and just fill it in. All right, and then the finishing touches to my eyebrows is the e.l.f. Cosmetics, the brow gel. I go ahead and apply that. It's just a clear gel to make sure that they stay. a little bit and that is my brow y'all nothing too crazy nothing too time consuming because ain't nobody got time for that all right guys so that is my brow tutorial on some unruly brows yeah you know 
sometimes they get out of hand and we don't have time to go take care of them so you got to do what you got to do to get them back on track so if you have any questions on what products i use or what products you may use or if you want to find a dupe that's not so expensive as the anastasia beverly hills pomade definitely leave it down below and i'll let you know of some other products that i've used that were still good um but that's it don't forget to thumbs up this video don't forget to subscribe and hello don't forget to share it you can do it it's right next to that like button go ahead and share it to your friends and family we gotta be out here helping each other you know see you in the next one bye all the good things face looking at my past they right but i swear you came my way like an angel fell from the sky, no.